Challenge Cup. Tui Lolahe leads Huddersfield Giants to quarterfinal win against Hull FC. Huddersfield Giants are through to their first Challenge Cup semi-final since 2012 after overcoming Hull FC 24-16 at the John Smith Stadium, Wakefield Inn. Wigan meet in the last quarterfinal tie on Sunday. Fullback Tui Lolahe produced a man-of-the-match performance to lead Huddersfield to a 24-16 victory over Hull in their Betfred Challenge Cup quarterfinal at the John Smith Stadium. The Tonga international halfback, who is proving to be a revelation at fullback, ran the show and scored a try and six goals as the Giants snuffed out the prospect of a Hull derby in the last four. Recommended. One-fifth. Boris Becker found guilty of four charges under Insolvency Act. Read more. Recommended by. With both sides scoring three tries, the perfect goalkicking of Lolahe proved decisive as Huddersfield, who have not won the trophy since 1953, joined Hull KR and St. Helens in the lineup for the Elland Road semi finals on May 7. The lineup will be completed with Wakefield Trinity's home tie against Wigan on Sunday, when the semi final draw will be made. Hull, one of only two teams to beat the high-flying Giants in Super League so far this season, made the brighter start without being able to post any points. Early handling errors from scrum half Theo Phages and Lolahe made it an uncomfortable start for Ian Watson's men, who scored from their first meaningful attack, center Ricky Ludele demonstrating exceptional strength to force his way over the line after accepting standoff Jack Cogger's short pass. Lolahe added the angled conversion and kicked a penalty in the 19th minute for a high tackle to extend the Giants' lead to 8-0 as they began to dominate. The home side ought to have made more of a break by former Hull second rower Josh Jones and when winger Ashton Golding crossed at the corner, he was brought back for a forward pass. Unable to make much impression on the Giants' defense, Hull needed a lift and it came with the introduction from the bench of fit again Australian standoff. Josh Reynolds, whose delicate kick on the last tackle created a 27th-minute try for Joe Lavodua, gold by captain Luke Gale. The Giants responded five minutes later with a training field move in which Cogger switched the point of attack and Lolahe kicked into space for second rower. Chris McQueen to score their second try. Lolahe kicked the conversion and added another penalty awarded for offside on the stroke of half-time to make it 16-6. The black and white stayed in the contest when second rower Andre Savellio went through a gap in the Huddersfield defense for a 49th minute try and they almost scored again after center Josh Griffin pounced on a handling error by Phages. Lolahe got back to make the tackle and Griffin lost the ball as he stretched for the line. The miss began to look costly on 61 minutes when Huddersfield captain Luke Yates broke through heart of the visitors' defense and Lolahe had enough pace to finish off the move from 40 meters out. The fullback converted his own try and kicked a third penalty to maintain his 100% record but Hull had the final say when former Huddersfield winger Darnell McIntosh went over for a consolation try six minutes from the end.